Hello everyone, Moose Torrent here, and this is my Pure Sorcery King Mage build. Let's look at him in all of his rotund glory. Anyways, this obviously is going to be focused entirely on spells and equipment that boosts spell damage and more spells. So, let's start off. In our right hand, we have the Scholar's Candlestick. This was recently nerfed in patch 09, but it still increases your spell damage by 12%. I think it was 20, so it's still pretty good, even after the nerf, getting 12% there. In our left hand, we have the most important part, the Court Sorcerer's Staff. Once you get above 50 intelligence, here I have 55. The Court Sorcerer staff is going to be the best option for you, going to be doing the most damage. So that's why I picked up this one. At 50, I think it's actually tied. It is actually tied with the Sorcerer staff, so <laughs> you can do either one at that point. For my armor, I have the Crown of Dusk. This <laughs> silly little headband actually increases your spell damage as well. And the only drawback is a negative 30 magic damage absorption. And since you don't see a lot of magic damage out there, this is really not that bad of a drawback. I have the Winged Knight armor, <laughs> just for that defense and gigantic stomach. Cornix wraps and Fire Witch leggings. For rings, I have the Scholar Ring. This increases your intelligence by 5 points, which is why I have the 55 intelligence. You can see the stats on the right hand side there. Chlorinthy ring, because you really need extra stamina, recovery speed when you're a sorcerer. And bellowing dragon crest ring and young dragon ring, both boosting sorceries, I believe by 15 and 10%. I'm not sure on that, but definitely they do boost sorceries. So let's get started with the sorcery. He's got Tears of Denial and the Lightning Buff. And it looks like that might have just saved him there. Yeah, his Tears of Denial is gone. And we killed him with the Scholar's Candlestick. Looks like we're going against the Dragon Slayer's Axe. I believe that's what it is. Nice to see that weapon. And nice to see that <laughs> opening barrage kill. I see the Lothric Shield and Painting Guardian Hood. It appears to be some sort of straight sword. Maybe a rapier? Looks like broadsword actually. Extremely large hitbox. <laughs> this guy is staying close. That's how you defeat the sorcerer. Got some great damage there from my full orb. Oh wow, he blocked a lot of that with the shield. Trading hits. That broadsword is massive in terms of damage. 200 there from the flash sword. Ooh, he's trying to Evelyn me. Oh, still alive. <laughs> oh, he's still alive. Oh, he's still alive. <laughs> Why won't you die? <laughs> six damage. Uh, six damage is all I needed, and I got it. We are going against the washing pole. 
That was terrible. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> Can't tell what he has. Oh, I think it's broadsword. Oh crap! Got blasted by that lightning spear. Let me blast him in the face with the crystal soul spear. So it sort of evens itself. So we got a miracle caster with the broadsword, apparently. Got him with a little flash sword. <laughs> we killed him by rolling at him. Havel's great shield and the dark sword. Looks like he's going for deep protection and lightning buff. Anything else? No? Ooh, look at that block. That was a ton of damage he blocked. He outsped me there. Looks like Dark Sword's still doing decent damage even after the patch. I guess it is buffed though. That I don't think really hit me, but... What you gonna do? Might be the bountiful sunlight. I hope I don't shoot the host here. Okay. That would have been annoying for him to do. Oh. Over already. So much spell power. Looks like a dark katana, maybe? I believe that's what it was. Drat. You spoiled my fun. Oh, this dude knows how to strafe. Strafe to the left, strafe to the right. I can't handle the strafe, whatever. Whatever direction it is. I just can't do it. <laughs> Woo! That flash sword laying it down. Twin blades there. How come you're not supposed to attack people when they're buffing? But it's okay if I'm trying to use soul mass. Anyways, 812 damage to the face. Sort of makes up for it, I think. Let me get my little Farin dart. Blast him right in the nipple. I think we'll finish things off. Or stab him in the kidney. Either way. Straight sword and Kestis. I will not have anything for him to parry. Unless I go off with my knife. Oh, shot the host. Poor host. He's been he's been so gracious to me. 23 damage. 100 damage. Right out of stamina. That's why I need that Chlorinthy ring. Ugh, right out of stamina again. Ninety-nine damage that time. No! <laughs> if you would have attacked me, it would have been over. Wow, we came back. Thanks to Fair and Flash Sword. I think that was like five in a row, four or five in a row. 
Now we're fighting the host. <laughs> this mage is epic. Oh my god, so powerful. Plus my spinning tactic. Very good. Then shoot him in the sack. Woo! Can't stop it. Looks like the Black Knight Glaive. Guy likes to get really close and bow to people. As long as he doesn't attack me, I'm cool. Trading hits there. Not often do you trade hits with a sorcery. <laughs> 97 damage. My fair and dark. And 621 from the Baron Flash. If you're going pure sorcerer, I definitely recommend using that. If you have a sword in your right hand already, maybe not. But if you don't, very good. And then you run out of Estus or what is it? Weapon art bar, FP bar, focus bar. <laughs> oh my god, you guys fully charge R2 from the Scholar's Candlestick for the win. Looks like our opponent is spinning around in circles as we accidentally shoot the wall with a... <laughs> He's clapping for me. Yeah, yeah. Wow, he triggered our soul mass. I don't know if he did that on purpose or not. But it was a good move. Darted him in the face. Maybe the chest. He's trying to box us. Oh my god, he has a Dragon Slayer's Great Axe on his back. Very close there. Flash shortage. Ooh, he went for his poise weapon art. Then some gut shots. Ah, oh, I heard the, the noise like he got hit, but no damage. <laughs> I was going blind there. Oh, he's still alive. <laughs> Scholar's Candlestick saves us again. We're going against the Black Knight Greatsword, which is an ultra greatsword. Ooh, this guy looks like he has an idea of how to beat the sorcerer. But <laughs> so far, not doing so well. Really, if you want to win, just stay super aggressive, and you'll out-damage them, and they won't be able to hit you. So, hang in there. Whoa. Oh, he got me! Good game. Looks like we're going against a straight sword. The Llewellyn Shield. Missed our volley attack. Oh, we got him with the Scholar's Candlestick, though. Ah, that's the Lothric Knight Sword. Very, very good straight sword. Seems like most of the straight swords are in Dark Souls 3 are just very good. I love that the Soul Mass does damage when you roll into people. So awesome. This is Moose Torrent, and I'll be back with another video for you guys shortly.